Hey there, it's Duke Ferguson, owner, CEO, and master trainer of Unleashed Potential Canine and creator of Dog Training Genesis. See what this veterinarian has to say about our dog training services after she was told to put her dog to sleep when Prozac and a muzzle and the positive-only training failed to produce the results she needed. Uh, my name is Kobe Vandergeesen. This is Harley. Um, I'm a vet student from ABC, and I'll graduate tomorrow. Um, Harley is about six or seven years old. I got it from the Humane Society, so it's kind of a guess. And he had been previously owned, and I didn't know anything about his history. Um, but he entered the board and train um, program after I had him for about a year and had some problems with him. Okay, so before um, Harley entered the program, he had pretty well every problem I could think of with regard to his behavior. Um, he was aggressive about everything. He was aggressive about toys. He was aggressive about food. He was aggressive about my own belongings. He was aggressive about his crate. crate. Um, he would bite me. He was always really, really nervous and really anxious. Um, so I wasn't sure of his history, and I still don't really know what happened to him. Um, but he was always really, really nervous around people, um, me talking to him in any sort of a stern voice, trying to discipline him, he really couldn't handle it. Um, and any direct confrontation, he'd really get aggressive. Um, my relationship was obviously strained with him at that point um, and for the entire year because I worked on him so hard and tried everything um, and it was tough to take him anywhere. I had trouble when I would go away to board him with somebody because I would be nervous about what he would do and I couldn't trust him with people. So um, some of the things I tried, we tried the basic obedience, obviously. Um, we tried, I spoke to an animal behaviorist. I got as far as trying Prozac, um, to, just in case he did have a mood disorder at some point. Um, and then the final thing that was recommended to me was that if the Prozac didn't make a difference, that I would have to put him to sleep. Um, and that had actually been recommended to me months for months before the training even had entered my mind um, and Prozac was just kind of a last resort at that point before I even um, became aware of the training. Okay, so after training, um, after Harley did the board and train, I had been away and I left him the entire time and came back to see an entirely new dog who was also, the first thing I noted was just externally he was a lot happier, he was a lot calmer, the look on his face wasn't so anxious, um, and then just seeing him listen, like he listened to Duke, he listened to me, like he listens to my roommate now, and um, he can come to the park with me and I don't have to worry about him being aggressive towards other people if they come to ask me if they can pet him, I can say yes. Um, I can take him to the park to play with other dogs. His life is better because I can take him places now. Um, my life is better because I can take him places and not worry about him trying to attack somebody or me not being able to handle him in public. Um, he comes everywhere with me now because he can, because he's perfect. <laughs> What's the biggest change you notice in him? Probably his attitude. He's happy. He's not stressed out doing nothing. Like, he would sit in my house 
and just be stressed out the entire time. Nothing was going on, but he would worry about guarding something. And now he just relaxes at home. And and if I say something, he gets all happy about going somewhere. But definitely his attitude. What did you like most about the training that you took? Um, he was really easy to talk to. Um, I could call him whenever I wanted. I was away, and so I got um, frequent updates on him. Um, if I had questions after the after the fact, after the training, if I had questions, I could get in touch with him whenever. The group sessions were fantastic, even though I couldn't make some of them. Um, Harley loves him, and so obviously he didn't have a bad experience with him, and so. Everything went more than I expected. It was so much better. Did you get the results you were looking for? I got the results I was looking for and then some. recommend Kings County K9 to absolutely anybody who has a dog um, with any sort of issues because it changes their whole outlook on I think on their life because it's it doesn't change their behavior in a bad way at all it makes them so easy it makes them happy to be controlled it makes your relationship a million times better um, and it's a great training method. Um, from everything that I've used on Harley, this has been the only thing that's worked and has definitely given the best results with absolutely no real glitches that I've come across. And most of all, he is happy with it. So. Awesome. But, Are you dealing with dog problems? Maybe aggression or a dog that runs away or won't come, pulls in a leash, or just won't play and listen? Have you been told by another trainer or another professional behaviorist that your dog is untrainable or should be put to sleep? If so, contact an Unleashed Potential trainer today and get another opinion. My trainers deal with problem dogs every single day. Dogs that have been deemed untrainable or set for euthanasia for some strange reason. So there is still hope. And if there's no trainer and you can't find a trainer in your area, then be sure to check out my Dog Training Genesis online video program. It's step-by-step, -step, it's very in-depth, and it will help you out. It's helping hundreds of people out worldwide, just like you. So for your convenience, I'm going to leave the links to everything I spoke about below in the description box. Now it's just that much more easy for you to get success and get closer to your goals. I thank you for watching, and if you would like to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe.